hey everyone and welcome back to our channel in today's video we are going to show you how to authenticate a domain on system io let's begin authenticating your domain on system io ensures that your emails are delivered securely and are less likely to land in spam now the first thing that you need to do is to log in using your credentials if this is your first time in System.io, I want you to click the sign up option. And by following the on-screen instructions, you'll be able to log in successfully. And I want you to go to the upper right corner where you can see your profile icon. There should be an option that says settings. Click on it. And then you need to access your domain's DNS settings. All right. That's going to be around here. In the left side panel of your dashboard, click the custom domains. All right. Now, if you want to add a domain, basically click this button right here and type in the domain that you have, especially if, if it's provided by another hosting company or platform. In my case, this is my domain. It's deeplabs.com. It's powered by Squarespace. All right. So I'm going to quickly go to, I'm going to copy this right now and switch over to system io and then click on the add domain type in here and click on save what will happen is you would be forwarded to this section just wait for it, it takes a little while it is checking the authenticity all right now this is where you want to configure all the information because system io will provide you with the following dns records all right now the c name is something you need to use to connect your domain with system io all right it's typically a triple w dot or a subdomain and the value is c name with a custom kind of like this all right so i want you to go to your hosting provider in my case that's going to be squarespace i'm going to copy this one for now and then we're gonna take it it's a drag because you have to switch back and forth for the hosting provider and system io or you just want maybe you can copy and paste it to a wordpad or notepad for it's a lot easier and then from here i'm gonna click on the uh, square space and click the domains and then from here as you can see all i have to just click the domains all right and then go to the dns now here we need to configure a lot of things all right we need to add a new record that's going to be trip triple w's and that's going to be c name remember the data and going to be i'm putting in the information about system io all right and i want you to click on save now once you added that all i have to do is click on save and then save changes and wait for the propagation all right because dns propagation can take up to 48 hours so when you go hover back to the system io you don't have any much choice but to wait for it because we need the system to verify the domain in system io all right and as you can see the uh, validation is pending and you just have to wait for it until it's verified and it takes for 24 to 48 hours but sometimes it's usually faster depending on the traffic network and when i get once again once the dns records are propagated your domain will be verified there's going to be a three dot icon here if you click on settings right here if you want to add an email address for contact and submissions while doing that you might want to put some information here such as for example if you want to add a logo right here you can do that and click to upload click on save so you can do all of these while waiting all right and then now after 24 to 48 hours all right and you need some helping locating your dns settings or adding new records and you're having issues with that you might want to go to the help center here click the get in touch with customer support this is going to be one of the easiest way for you because one of the customer support staff will give you troubleshooting steps and guidelines on how to fix if you encounter all right any problems along the way but normally you just have to wait for 24 to 48 hours because the uh, it takes a little while once the dns records are propagated because it depends really on the traffic you know sometimes there are a lot of factors and you want to make sure that you have an active internet subscription and it's all is set you can also send a test email from system io to confirm that your domain authentication is working correctly how well we have a separate video on how to authenticate your email domain 
here in System IO. You might want to check that as well. Thank you so much for watching, guys. We will see you again in the next video.